Hi, this is Corey Chase with Captain Jack for Adult DB Talk. So first of all, just tell me a little bit about Corey Chase. Uh, Corey Chase, um, the long and the short of it. We'll stick to the short story. I am... I guess I could say one of the original MILFs in this industry. Um, I started playing a MILF when I was 24. I am now 37. So I, in a sense, have um, become a mom through porn, if that makes sense. <laughs> yes, it does. Okay. Um, so you got in the industry at a later date. I mean, 24 is later than you know the te teenagers that come in. What kind of, did you have any jobs, regular jobs before? Uh, yes, um, before I got into porn, or as I was getting into porn, I was a paramedic um, for a private ambulance company. I was in the army, um, and I was also in catering before when I was getting out of high school and well, that's why I find you, myself. Why yeah. range your background? So were you a very sexual person before you joined the industry? Uh, sexual? I wouldn't say outrageously sexual. I had my own experiences when growing up, first times. Um, I never experimented with girls uh, before I got into the porn industry, other than like kissing and making out with girls, but nothing sexual mm. in nature. So then why did you decide to join the porn industry? Okay. Actually, I might switch this mic real quick. Okay. Are you picking me up on the Yeah, for some reason. It's just better sounding. I think you just wanted to clip it and record it. This is a lot closer. Right. Well, yeah. Talk like this? No, no, you're good. <laughs> you're great. Yeah. Are you getting, like, I feel the wind blowing right on my chest, too, so. Because that thought the wind is right yeah, there on you? So I don't know if you're picking up that more. Yeah, maybe. Let's see. Let's see about that. So just start where I left off? Something? Saying something. Yeah. Just start where I left off? Yeah. So why did you decide to join the porn industry? Um, I decided to join the, the porn industry because I found out that I really, really, really enjoyed um, people watching me have sex. Um, I got into the porn industry. Me and my husband, boyfriend at the time, enjoyed uh, videotaping us having sex. So... We had this whole private collection of home movies on high eight little tape, uh, VHS tapes, if you will. And um, I got into some modeling, and one thing leads to another, and it just snowballs, and we start selling our own private collection. Typical porn question, what's your favorite position? Um, right now is that kind of side spoon, not a spoon, it's like that you're laying on your side, legs up in the air, and the guy's like straddling your other leg, like a scissor. Okay. So okay. it's nice and deep, I love it. Okay. So what do you like sexually? What gets you wet? What gets you wet? Um, being watched, having sex, gets me wet. Are you submissive or dominant sexually? Both. Um, it really depends on my mood. I would probably say I'm more dominant sexually than submissive sexually. Uh, I really only am more submissive um, with my husband than most of the other male actors that I have sex with. So you have a lot of sex. How often do you master? Never. <laughs> never really, because I, I am camming now. So I masturbate on cam almost every single night. So in a sense, uh, every single night. <laughs> so when you can, what's the, like, the weirdest or kinkiest request a, a person's made of you to do? The weirdest and kinkiest request? Um, uh, they always want to see you defecate. Um, the eating of like goldfish for the boar um, is really weird. I, I don't do either of them, but that's you'd probably the kinkiest thing I've ever done. Now I have a lot of different fetishes that I've shot video content for, so some things might be weird to others that I don't really find it being very odd. Sure. Uh, when a guy comes, what do you prefer? What do you want? Uh, the mouth. I love swallowing. Oh. 
Yeah. Are you a science queen? Do you like huge cocktails? No, average is better. Average is definitely better. Oh, you do anal occasionally. When was your first anal experience? Uh, first anal experience was actually on videotape um, with my husband, and it didn't work. It didn't even get in. <laughs> it didn't even fit. I'm like, nope, and I cut it at that. Like a finger was the first. Digit. It was. It was embarrassing. Do you enjoy? Do you enjoy it now? Yes, I love it. I can come from anal play now. It's it's amazing. Do you have any? Fan- You've been in it for 13 years. So do you have any fantasies you want to live on the camera still? Uh, fantasies off camera. What's that? It's like having sex off camera. People still do that. <laughs> <laughs> what have you learned about yourself sexually since you joined the industry? Um, everything. Really? I've learned almost everything about myself. Um, uh, finding out that I love having people watch me have sex. I've learned to love um, directing people while I have sex. It's a great turn on. Um, finding out different fetishes that really turn me on, like the wet and messy, with the grunge all over, like the slime. I didn't realize how much I love that. Um, and the underwater content, and just like masturbating underwater, holding my breath. I mean, everything that I've done so far has been a new experience for me. And then finally, how can the fans find me on social media? Uh, social media, Twitter is Corey Chase Triple X. I have a backup, the Corey Chase. My Instagram got taken down, so I started up a new one. It's called the Corey Chase as well. I'm on Tumblr for the time being, um, Corey Chase Triple X. And if you want a one-stop shop, it's CoreyChaseCustoms.com. It has links to everything: my ABN store, clips for sale, many vids, my free cams, the slew of internet porn out there. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you.